Give me that sauce. I should have been sleeping all of these, but holy fuck. Oh my God, I'm cracked as fuck. Oh, there's something thick in that. You can see it. Oh, oh, oh my fucking God. What's good, boys? I hope you are excited for today's video. Hello, I am bro. holding a ridiculously, ridiculously expensive NFL trading card box. This is Panini Impeccable, a $5,000 NFL trading card box, which some of you have already seen one card of the opening. If you watch the Fubi Christmas vlog, I gave everyone in there a surprise and I opened one card out of the eight. And I won't reveal what that was if you didn't see it. Now, what's extra cool about this, back when I bought this like a month ago, I thought the best pull was gonna be Mac Jones. I thought that was off offensive rookie of the year. I think Jamar Chase is gonna get offensive rookie of the year now. So instead of Mac Jones, I think the absolute most cracked pull we could get in this is Jamar Chase. This thing is five grand, there's only eight cards in here. So I hope that tells you just how rare and ridiculous these cards are going to be. And once we finish that, we will be opening uh, this Panini XR box. It's got two packs with seven cards each. So this thing wasn't five grand, it's like 500 bucks, but still there's only 14 cards in here. So everything we're about to open today is insanely rare. And I finally think that now that the regular season is over and the voting has commenced this is the perfect time to open this holy shit buckle in boys let's find ourselves in jamar chase if you didn't see any of my openings last year they were crazy these boxes are absolutely stacked with some insane nfl training cards so i could absolutely get clapped and i could get the most useless rookies players who never even touched the field this season but bro if i get a jamar chase i'm gonna freak the fuck out so here's what's in the box it features an 172 card set so I'm hoping one out of 172 is Jamar Chase. There's 100 base cards numbered to 75, 42 rookie helmet and patch autos, and 30 rookie autographs. And there's a bunch of randomly inserted cards in there too. So uh, as you guys know, I'm not like the biggest NFL trading card wizard. It turned out last year I would pull cards that were super expensive that I didn't even know. So please let me know in the comments if you guys are into this stuff. But I do know that if I see Jamar Chase or Mac Jones or Michael Parsons, that we are in business. So here's this beautiful stack of cards right here oh shoot i can't show you guys that stupid oh, what a loser so here is every single this is five thousand dollars of nfl trading cards right here now i am giving a little spoiler i will show you the card that i showed on the fubi christmas vlog this is not news to me you guys have already seen this some of you and some of you have not it is an absolutely gorgeous diami brown so it's got an auto a piece of his helmet and a piece of his jersey on it. i actually don't know what this is called in the trading card world i'm used to a rookie patch auto which is like a piece of the jersey in the auto but this is a rookie helmet patch auto rookie helmet patch auto Auto? Is that a thing? Absolutely stunning card. I'm not like that huge on Deami Brown, but hey, if the Washington football team gets a super legitimate quarterback, I'm sorry, yeah. Heineke, and they start playing well, Deami Brown could be nasty. You never know. So that concludes the part of this pack opening that I have already seen and some of you have already seen. So there's seven cards left that literally nobody has seen yet. We're just gonna go top down. I'm gonna pull it up so that me and you guys can see it at the exact same time. I'm definitely seeing yellow. I'm seeing a Steelers player. It is, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, so it's not an auto. Okay, it's not a patch or a helmet or anything, but this is a 49 of 50. T.J. Watt. Well, he's getting Defensive Player of the Year this year. He absolutely has to get Defensive Player of the Year. I know this one isn't crazy, but a 49 of 50 on his Defensive Player of the Year. That is so awesome, dude. That's so crazy. In 2020, he had 15 sacks. So in 2021, now 22 and a half. He only played 15 games, too. This guy is a god. He would have the record, and it wouldn't even be close if he was healthy all 17. Although, if you really want to play that game, Reggie White got 20. We don't care. Let me tell you, right, let me tell you <laughs> we don't care. Next one, I'm seeing purple. I believe it's a Raven. Is that J.K. Dobbins? It is. 23 of 35 J.K. Dobbins. I love the rarity on it. I am bummed out that J.K. Dobbins got hurt at the start of the season. He was gearing up for really what would have been an incredible season. I wish J.K. Dobbins had stayed healthy this year, but you know what? It's not an auto or a patch or any of that either. So I'm kind of okay with this J.K. Dobbins. I see an auto on this one. I'm really hoping this is Jamar Chase right here. I see a car that might be orange out of my peripherals. Is it? Oh, it's red. Wait, who is that? Is that, um, you know what, dude? You know what? 
what? He's actually had a solid season. Is it Joe Tryon Shayinka? I may be mispronouncing that. I apologize if I am. But this is the Buccaneers rookie. Joe Tryon Shayinka. The rarity is 49 of 99. I don't actually know what can be in this. I don't know if I can get multiple rookie autos. I hope this isn't my only one. It's still a clean card. This is so sick. I have literally no idea what you call this, but this is so fucking sick. It's like a Super Bowl James White card, and it's the fucking Falcons choke Super Bowl 2. This is so sick. It's signed. And this isn't one of those signatures that they put on the sticker and then slapped on the card. This is directly on the card. James White, 25 of 25. This is so sick. I have no idea if that's worth anything, if it's worth a lot, if it's worth literally nothing, but it is super cool. Next up, this is a legend player. I can tell by the picture, but I don't know who it is yet. It's for the Bills. Take a guess. It is a... Oh, oh it's signed too. Yo! Thurman Thomas. Indelible auto. I believe they call it indelible yet, bro. That's actually sick. I don't personally know any big Thurman Thomas. That's an O. That is an O six of ten. There are only ten of these, and this is the sixth. That is super cool. So that is six cards out of eight. Oh my god! Oh my! Oh my fucking god! Oh my fucking god! Oh my god! Oh my fucking god! It's a rookie helmet auto, Jamar Chase. Holy fuck! Holy fuck! I mean, like, I have card sleeves. So I should have been sleeving all of these, but holy fuck! Oh my god, I actually got fucking Jamar Chase! No shot! No shot! He even put his jersey number on there, and he smudged it with his fucking thumb. Look at this! What the fuck? Oh my god! We actually got fucking Jamar Chase! Dude, it's so crispy! Jersey, how, just like the Diami Brown. So we got Diami Brown and Jamar Chase. Dude, he even puts the jersey number on there! Oh my god, I can't believe that happened! So a little bit of me knows that this, it's not crazy rare, there's 75 of these, but this is the this is the offensive rookie of the year who is shaping up to be one of the best wide receivers in the NFL. Already is kind of like top five. If anyone wants to let me know what that's worth, that would be amazing. And our, oh fuck. All right, well that was just like insane emotions to none. Our final card, we actually doubled up. I didn't actually know you could do this. We doubled up on JK Dobbins. I got Jamar Chase, I don't care at all. Oh my God, that just happened. That's so sick. It literally could have been anybody. All right, I'm keeping these in impeccable condition until I get like perfect. There's like big like silver plastic cases you can get for these, right? I gotta get one of those. I'm ordering them. Literally, I'm going on Amazon right now. I'm ordering. Dude, that's so exciting. Dude, and last year, I don't know if you guys saw it, but I pulled this like Tom Brady silver coin card. I don't even know what it was, but that shit's fucking insane. So I have two really cool cards in my collection. And as you guys should know, I still have my Jalen Hurts card in my collection. That's how I got Jalen Hurts in Wheel of Mutt. So one of these days when I'm dirt poor, my bank account is completely drained from OnlyFans thoughts and my tier 18 sub to Pokimane, I'm gonna start selling off my NFL trading cards and I think I should be good for uh -huh. another week or two. Here's what we're opening next. That, I, I don't think I'm gonna be able to top that, but this should still be really fun. Panini XR, I should find two autos and one memorabilia card per box on average. So memorabilia is gonna be like a, you know, a piece of a jersey or a piece of a helmet. Seven cards per pack, two packs per box. So there's actually only 14 cards in here as well. So this one's, these ones are relatively rare as well. So let's see what our first one's got, baby. Only seven cards, damn, I didn't actually realize, I'm gonna be totally honest, I didn't realize there's only seven cards per pack. I totally thought these were really gonna be like a little more juice than the last one, but I really like the art on these. First one is David Johnson. Would have been pretty gnarly like four years ago when he was actually good at football. <clears throat> we don't have to go there. We get a digs and it has some form of rarity to it. It is 162 of 249 digs. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but 245 of 249. Nothing crazy. Still clean Monty Rice right here. And ooh, what is this? This is kind of, dude, I really like the art on these. This is a Devontae Adams. Not sure what type of card they're calling that, but he is 06 of 149. It's honestly pretty dope. Extra, extra. The Packers tried several tricks to free Adams in 2020 and one was particularly effective lining him up in the slot he ran 30 percent of his routes from the slot oh don't tell me this is my auto maybe he's a stud and i don't know what i'm talking about but nico collins is one of my potential two autos uh -huh. yeah i don't know who that is I'll be totally honest. 77 of 99, Nico Collins. This is what I mean, though. Like, I literally could have got this dude in my Panini Impeccable box, but instead we got Jamar fucking Chase. That's so sick. 
And the final one in it is literally a guy I've actually never heard of, Chaz Surratt. So we're gonna end it out with two guys I never heard of, but hey, one L pack means our next pack is a W. Second pack, sauce me up, baby. Give me that, give me that sauce. Oh, there's something thick in that. You can see it. There's something thick in there. This could be good, boys. And I like this start a lot better. Josh Jacobs. I like that running back a lot better than David Johnson. We're on to something here. Oh, look at that. I get another TJ Watt. This pack's looking good right now, boys. We're going to get a Miles Jack 199 of 199. The final one made. Peyton Turner. 109 of 199. He's got the Houston jersey on in the pick. That's hard. All right, so already this is a lot better pack than the last one. We haven't got the thick card yet. I'm going to get a... It's flipped backwards, which makes me think it's something really good. Yo! Wait, this is sick! Oh, oh my god, my god. Philip Rivers? It is a two of 25 Philip Rivers with, I believe, a piece of his jersey on there. XR Summit, Philip Rivers. Yo, I'll let you guys check this out. Dude, that's so dope. That is a dope card, dude. Let's go. All right, so we get Philip Rivers. Oh, oh, oh my fucking god! Oh my god! Oh my god! It's like a triple patch auto. There's three separate pieces of his jersey up there. We got the autograph as well, and it's Najee Harris. Bro, that other pack was a fucking bum pack, and this one is cracked. What is going on here? Oh my God, Najee. We got the Najee auto. Bro, I got a Najee auto, Jamar Chase, Phillip Rivers jersey. Dude, that is so dope. The final card is actually, he's also had a solid season. It's not a patch auto or anything, but Demetric Felton has had a good season filling in uh, for some of those bronze running backs. That's sick. I got to do the same thing with these cards now. I got to just hold them tightly until I get my card sleeves in. This has been so much fun. I'm so glad I did this. I'm having an absolute blast. I had to tone myself down for last year last year bro i bought i bought like fucking 20 grand worth of nfl training cards and i didn't feel horrible because at least it's not money down the drain because technically these cards can have value in the future i get that but i don't really know what i'm doing so it is a waste of money i'm proud of myself for not going overboard like i did last year but i am so happy with how this opening went i actually don't want to open anymore because i don't think i can top that all right hey boys i love you so much thank you for watching as always i hope you enjoyed and uh you'll be back to your regularly scheduled madden content tomorrow and uh i'll talk to you later peace